Hey, welcome. I've just finished another great trading session. I've started with just one dollar. If you want to find out the result where I got with this small amount to, to what amount I got in the end of profit, watch this video till the end. Don't forget in the description to this video, you'll find a my personal promo code for you to use when you deposit. It gives you 50% to your deposit. So make sure to use that. Let's start right now. I'm all over. Let's go. Right guys, we're gonna start with a first option. It's gonna be a put option and I'm only using one dollar today. Let's find out where I can get with this amount. But basically here uh, we see that um, the, um, the amount um, the amount uh, that we place is really small that we are expecting it to grow by using a compound percentage and the decision um, making here is that we see that MACD was was um, about to cross the slower line which is which happened now you can see that and that's the decision and then you got a, a downtrend forming zigzag is looking down and we have crossed through in the Keltner channel through the middle that's another indication so everything was for a put option i think we're in yes and we got our first profit i spoke through the whole minute and let's move on with the next uh with our next option we'll we'll, we'll keep uh, because we don't have it's 191 we have we'll just keep going with one dollar and then we can move on Right, so what's happening here, we see that there was a, a bullish absorption, so that's a good sign, that's a good impulse, so therefore a call option for one minute, and let's wait for the result and continue. And here is another profit from this option, it's not huge, but we're, we can place now $2, so let's move on guys with our next option, and like using the compound percentage basically, um, from each, the profit from each option, we're placing it towards the next option. In case you don't know, but most of you guys know that I use this every time. Um, that's a really nice situation here. We got a strong upper trend going on, and although we got to a point where we could probably catch a pullback, let's try to catch a pullback because at this point, it got out of the channel so it, it likely it will come back in in into the channel at least so basically we're trying to catch a pullback at this point so let's wait for the result and continue and here is the profit from this option not a huge again but we are now able to place a four dollars let's have a look um, so we're gonna place four dollars towards the next option and let's find out let, let's find this uh, I like to switch between the assets and find this perfect scenario All right four dollars and let's look for it by the way guys don't forget to like subscribe and comment this helps channel really really well um, so I've been told so that'd be great if you can guys spare a second Right, let's make this put option over here. We got uh, pretty much everything like pointing to towards a um, a bearish mood, so a, a put option. But in this case, it looks like um, this is a pullback. So we enter, well, not at the top because it's moving further up, but we entered in the pullback. So the 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 idea here i think is that it's going to go back up for, so by the time our option finishes it would go in for this pullback and then go back down um yeah what did i say it, it should go back down not up so yeah let's wait for the time that's left i don't think it's much 10 seconds okay um and let's see wow where it's risky oh looks good yeah, so it started going back down. 
and we got eight dollars on the balance now so we can place the eight dollars towards the next option okay um let's have a look let's have a look do, 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 do. eight dollars and let's place let's switch to the next one and huh we got to a resistance there so let's go in with a put option because um, as we reach the resistance we are likely to to basically to bounce off it because it, it, it resists and we bounce off it um, maybe for a pullback that would be good for us because we only have one minute time so yeah let's wait for the result and as always continue there we are guys we got the profit from this option and it's getting into small two figures it's 14 dollars that we can place towards the next option so that's pretty good um we're moving pretty fast as you can see that was 86 percent payout this one has 92 for example that's a bit better uh, well that's whole uh, six percent it's not too bad sometimes they go pretty low sometimes they go down to 70 something and you might find yourself um, uh, it's looking good downtrend in full and we enter into the put option here with uh, I mean at at a point where kind of at the top of the pullback which is great so that's what we want so let's wait for the result of this option and continue and here it is let's let's put straight away $27 that we can place towards the next option looking really good by the way guys I, uh, I forgot to mention about a telegram group where you can learn about trading uh, the link is going to be in the description to this video the invitation link if you want to find out more about technical analysis indicators oscillators and just stuff in general um, for binary options or any any trading really it applies this knowledge is universal so yeah make sure to check that out and let's move on let's move on with this one here that looks like a nice indication for for us to go with a put option MACDs sh clearly showing um, a put option indication and also we have um, we have reached the resistance level there and it's, it looks like it's bouncing off it's going to test the middle and maybe it's gonna go through the middle actually at this point it has all the uh, possibility but let's wait for the result and see for ourselves and then continue here is the profit guys we're in fifty dollars already it's been uh, not 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 long it's been 12 minutes and we're in with uh, fifty dollars i'm gonna place fifty two dollars towards the next option it's not bad although we started with just one dollar you can see that you can you can get some nice um, nice amounts here and let's move on this is looking as a call option we see the the zigzag is up we, we've gone through the middle of the channel of the Keltner and then MACD is clearly also showing us price is gonna go up this is a nice actually situation to enter into um, into an option so let's wait for the result of this and continue oh what did we just get we just got uh, $52 return that was that's not too bad actually and nothing really changed but as you can see so I've made uh, another option again but as you can see what happens is that a lot of times 
and you can you know what's gonna happen but then the timing is is not always correct and at this point there was just not enough time so maybe if we went with one minute um, and a half two minutes as you can see it that's it works but the timing we almost lost the money because of the timing so it's a lot of times it's not what's gonna happen is when so that's a that's a good um, example of that so make sure to calculate your timing right as much as you can of course and here is the profit this is what was meant to be and it worked out and I'm glad we just we had this returned instead of there was just a second word went below okay so let's move on 90, 97 dollars almost a hundred dollars already we have and we're gonna place that towards the next option guys of course mm, and let's see the next uh, doo -doo -doo, next currency to use that's actually looking pretty good Um, this one, this one, hmm, that's not too bad, that's, there is a nice downtrend, I'm gonna go with it, oh, and even better, we entered at a pullback, at the top of a pullback, that's really nice, because uh, everything else is showing that the price is gonna go down, and for us not to catch this pullback, to enter at the top of a pullback, no chance, uh, of us uh, losing now because well there is a chance but a, but a, a lot smaller chance as it's never 100% but I think we're good let's wait for the result and continue and here it is guys we got our profit and we're into the three figures finally that's awesome. Uh, as you can see, the snowball effect works the magic. We got $186 on the balance, and we're gonna keep pushing that snowball to create even even a better amount there. So we're gonna place next 186, and we're gonna choose the next scenario, next um, next situation. I keep changing between the assets because you can find sometimes you can find this perfect situation like such as this one because you had uh, a nice formed downtrend pretty strong then you have let's just place 186 then you have um, the channel you see that, that that indicates for the price to go down then you got zigzag pointing down and you got MACD pointing down that's perfect situation this actually is also looking quite good except we have the the support level there so i'm expecting for a pullback to catch a pullback here as it will be pushed by the support level uh probably for a pullback only and then it will continue to fall down but for our time frame is enough we want to catch this pullback let's see if we can let's see if that was a correct decision and continue And great we're gonna place 350 towards the next option straight away and let's move on straight away to towards the next one um, as you can see this I don't know if it's gonna go through actually the middle because it's it's resisting there and it's more likely more likely it will go down but it might actually go through. Hmm. That's interesting. No, probably not. We're gonna go with the put option here because I don't see a, a strong growing. And the last candle um, ended up lower than the last peak. So it looks like it's losing power, losing... So it looks like it's losing the strength 
and I think this is a this was a good point to enter into the put option because we're expecting with losing the power we're expecting the price to drop so yeah let's wait for the result of this and continue and here is the profit guys 665 dollars and we're gonna place that towards the next option let's see yeah it's definitely gonna fall because the, it lost its strength completely right this is also looking like it's going down this is a very similar situation I think it's going towards the middle and it's probably gonna break the middle at this point because the the trend had lost its strength let's wait for the result of this and continue and here it is the profit from this option we're into the four figures finally guys we're gonna stop here this was a, an amazing session hope you enjoyed it i'll see you all next time all the best good luck and goodbye